And the floodlights are shining down on the players here in the Spanish capital of Madrid. We're at the Bernabeu. My name is Derek Ray, and with me for commentary is the former Arsenal and England fullback Lee Dixon. And this is where it all starts in the UEFA Champions League. The group stage and match day one. My goodness, so much to look forward to. It's Real Madrid against Paris Saint-Germain. Well, the first group stage of the Champions League is always exciting. Three points is vital for both teams to get off to a good start. Or a draw may be a good result as well. We're about to find out what happens. Well, PSG have been in building mode for many a year now. And make no mistake, Lee, the Champions League will be the most coveted prize of all for them to win. Yeah, absolutely. The group stages in the past have not been a real problem for them, but it's just getting over that final hurdle in order to get into semi-finals and finals and actually win the trophy. So a lot's expected of them because of that money, but they need to produce. Aidan Azar read it magnificently and intercepted. And the starting players for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois, the Belgian, will be in goal. Carvajal plays with Marcelo in the fullback positions. Toni Kroos plays with Luka Modric in central midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. And here is the initial 11 for Paris Saint Germain. Alphonse Areola between the posts. Thiago Silva plays alongside Marquinhos in central defence. Ander Herrera starts. Are they going to forge ahead? Clattered away. Cross with the corner. And Areola acquits himself magnificently. As deep-lying playmakers go, Luka Modric has few that can match him. What do you expect to see from Modric? Well, he'll run the game, he really does. He wants to be on the ball, he wants to move. Well, it might still work out for them. Azar on the ball. Toni Kroos. Well, Lee Dixon, there's no getting away from the fact that Real Madrid are Champions League royalty. Absolutely, Derek. There's certain clubs around the world, Barcelona. Useful looking ball. Just unable to take advantage of that developing situation. Here's Carvajal. Well, not really a shooting moment he's going to be especially proud of, Lee. Well, he did have other options, but he thought, you know what, I'm just going to have a go. Minier. Running with the ball confidently. Neymar. Opportunity to take the lead. And a powerful effort, but just lacking accuracy. Yeah, narrowly wide, Derek. Decent effort. He smashed it. In possession, Marcelo. Really good reading of the game to win possession back. It's a really good-looking Paris Saint-Germain attack. What will they do next? And caught with ease, no real threat from the cross. Benzema. Playing with purpose and control. He could pick out a teammate. Cross! Might still be able to do a bit of damage. Benzema, here's Casemiro, that is a moment he would dearly love to have back if possible. Yeah, it wasn't his best effort, was it? But I bet he thought, I haven't got anything on, why not try a shot? Under Herrera. Cavani. Oh, stylish ball. What can they do now? I must say, no shortage of space. Higher towards Edinson Cavani at the back post. 
I don't think in the grand scheme of things he's going to be terribly proud of that headed attempt. Well, heading practice in training next week, that was pretty average, to be fair. Casemiro. Tony Kors. Azar. Happy to pass the ball, but remaining patient. Goalkeeper's ball, and was always going to be. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. Mbappe with it. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. And that. Well, not a cross that will live long in the map. And the first half is in the history books here. At And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Under Herrera. An abundance of space. And he just let his opponent glide by. And a goal here, Cavani! First goal of the contest. Well, we're going to see the replay here. You can't head the ball in the net if you don't get any crosses in. The crosses are coming in thick and fast, and that was a beauty. That made the goal. Well, let's go back to the goal that was scored. And underway again here with PSG in front. Modric, Carvajal. Now Casemiro. And moving the ball nicely. In possession, Marcelo. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Exquisite pass from Casemiro. Benzema's pass, not accurate enough. Casemiro, oh a nice looking pass, can they square the game, what a vital intervention. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. Corner kick delivery from Tony Kroos. Just unable to take advantage of that developing situation. Benzema! And a goal! The keeper couldn't stop it. Real Madrid on turns. Let's have another look at this. He wasn't expecting the ball, but when it comes to him, he chooses early to volley it. What a finish. Well, let's have another view of that goal. So, a level contest. 1-1. Under Herrera. And green space galore for PSG. He has time to play it over. Well, it might still work out for them. He succeeds in clearing it. Well, Derek, still all square, but how? How's the keeper saved that? Marcelo. In full control of the ball here. Benzema. Look at Modric. And the keeper making sure that there were no scraps to feed on for the attackers. Heading 
Edinson Cavani now. Minier, Cavani. It did appear that they might be onto something, but not so. Modric. Rafael Varane. Casemiro. Inside the last quarter of an hour. This is Neymar. Herrera. Promising sequence. Di Maria. Can they take the lead? The importance of that tackle cannot be overstated. The ball with Luka Modric. This is course. Well, listen to that noise. Real Madrid fans going absolutely berserk. Trying to urge their team on for a winner. Not what he was intending. Bad pass. It will be a Paris Saint-Germain free kick. PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front. Five minutes remaining and level pegging here. Every goalkeeper would expect to catch that one. Karim Benzema. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Spot on with that tackle. He's given it straight to the opposition. Illegal play, and hence a free kick. The referee has dished out a yellow card here. Well, it's not malicious, it's just clumsy. We've been waiting to find out. Now we know a minimum of three added minutes here. Hazard. Modric. Here's Carvajal. And level as is in the closing moments. Can Real Madrid change that? It needs an accurate cross. And a half-baked clearance. And the flag has gone up here, offside the decision. And giving them the gift of possession. The end of the story tonight at any rate, and hardly the perfect start for Real Madrid. They'll feel that two points have been frittered away in their opening game. Well, it's not ideal. You can drop points here and there in the group stages, but not too many. A little bit more emphasis.